My name is Ted Sovey. I uh, was born and raised in Marinette. Graduated from Marinette High School in 1949. I was a 49er. And I went on uh, to the Great Lakes and sailed on the Great Lakes. And I qualified with the minimum amount of time to go to school to get a Great Lakes Coast Guard license that would en enable me to be a Great Lakes officer on bulk freighters. I did that until 1954 when I was drafted into the Army. And at that time, I was third mate with the Ann Arbor Car Ferries that ran into Marinette Menominee Harbor. And I spent two years in the Army during the uh, Korea era. The shooting war of Korea was already over in 53, but the draft was still on. So I qualified for the draft, spent two years. I didn't see Korea, but I saw a lot of Alaska. I was on the what they call a dual line radar network chain. Every 50 miles across northern uh, Alaska and Canada, uh, the United States was going to put a, uh, a radar station up there. And my job was to operate at LCM, taking construction material to, from the ship to the shore. And uh, we left Seattle, a port of embarkation, Took about 20 days to get to our spot up in the Arctic Ocean. I've got several uh, photos I'd taken when I was in the Army there of icebergs and so forth. And therefore, we went through the Unimac Pass and Bering Sea. I could see the image of Russia in the background. And therefore, we went up to uh, Point Barrel and Point Long story short, my tenure in the Army was very, very enjoyable. I had some good uh, occupation, uh, far much better than some of the other ones that were toting a rifle and so forth. I was stationed aboard an FS supply vessel in Fort Lucis, Virginia for about 16 months, and I had the rare distinction of taking a troop train from the East Coast to the West Coast of the United States, from Newport News, Virginia, all the way up to Fort Lewis, Washington, which is really, really nice. So therefore, that's a little bit about my military. I've been uh, on the county board for over 40 years, and I had uh, various committee assignments, committee chairs, and I served as county board chairman for eight consecutive years, and currently I'm chairman of the new development committee of the county board, which I was reelected in this past April. I've been married for, will be 64 years come Tuesday, June 26th, and to my wife uh, Agnes, who is not in the best of health, but still she's with us. And also uh, um, the uh, uh, time that I spent, uh, I've always maintained my residency of Marinette, but I went to school in Buffalo, New York, got my Coast Guard license, and therefore, uh, my residency was always Marinette, and I'm very, very proud to be a member of the city of Marinette. I felt that if I could contribute something to making our um, community and our county better, that would be my ultimate goal, and I think I've proved that over the years. Well, I would say if you're sort of disillusioned with anything that the city or the county does, put your name on a ballot and try to get yourself elected to make uh, changes that is acceptable and to make our county and our city a little bit better place to live. Oh my God, should I go take this list then and go from there? Whatever makes it easiest for you. Well, it makes it easier to answer the questions, but sure. yeah, um, okay. Uh, are you ready? Oh yeah, let's yeah. go. Yeah. Let's go. The, old, the old expression, shoot the sherbet to me, Herbert. <laughs> a good deal, Lucille from Mobile. <laughs> She's going to be laughing. And, well, anyway. <laughs>